fancy little friend. So you look so high. Watch me now. Watch me fly. I'm Peter. I can do anything. <laughs> I saw her so high. I am forever. He has such it's, a sweet smile, dude. It's a magic. I love his smile. It's hard to explain it. <laughs> I feel like I could just jump up, I swear, and take off. But I think too hard about it. I might do it. <laughs> <laughs> you can feel you can feel um the energy, everything around you, you just feel it. The energy from the moon, or the plants, everything around you. It's wonderful. He is so spiritual. I, um, I love it. I think mean, nature, I was. animals, and all those things are very inspirational to my work. I play off of those things with children. And um, to stimulate ideas, uh, creates all kind of things. I just can't tell you. I think the majority of my success is from these sources. And some people say, well, go into detail, but it's hard. You really can't. It's just the whole world of it. You just well, I mean, the if you know, you know. I think know, it's the same so. thing what inspires painters and sculptors and people of the arts. It's the whole world of it. It's just special. What I like to do is, um, I'll probably get my sister down here and just go we'll just sit around and talk. And she'll tell you some of her magic experiences and stories. What are you talking about? Oh, okay. What? What's right on my here. Lap? I what? don't know what it is. <laughs> it's not and it's off now. It's off. You it's see important. it? I don't care. Anyway, I was just talking oh, about. Wait. <laughs> I've never seen any videos. I was talking about the toy, dusk though. and the magic of dawn. Will you be quiet, you fat head rascal? <laughs> and I, what I wanted to ask you was, what inspires you? Musically or what? Anything. I mean, what inspires you uh, to create things, or musically, or makes you feel good? What? I would I would say the sound of the ocean. I like the beat. Right. Musically, that inspires me because I see the creation of God when I he listen to all the different sounds, the ocean and that roar. That That's what I spoke about earlier. Oh, really? I said the same thing. You're yeah. kidding. Aww. <laughs> um, what, what do you think is the main thing you want to do in the future? What's your ultimate goal? My ultimate goal is to be a multifaceted performer. Uh, such as Barbara Streisand and Diana Ross. I think actually they're the only two that have really combined music as well as this acting. This is so together. iconic. That's true. And that's what I'd like to do. Of course, right. everybody wants to be where you are right now, but that's what I'd like to do. I haven't done anything. I feel like oh, I just yeah. started. Just beginning. That's well, um, I'm sir? <laughs> it's cold, my friend. No, it is. It is magic. How can you say it's cold? It's a wonderful night. It's magic out here. Are you cold, really? I'm not. A little bit. Well, because of the water that, you know, it's falling over. It's, it's clear. It's beautiful. It's, it's wonderful out here. So, the um, falls look pretty? Yeah, very pretty. It's, it's pretty nice. It's pretty nice. It's a, it's a perfect thing to be doing this tonight. Really. I remember this for a long time. Anyway, um, <laughs> what else would you like to, to say? Some of your dreams. I love the tour oh. right now. Oh, dreams in life? Yes. <laughs> I thought you were those terrible dreams I had. No. <laughs> I got an idiot for our sister, folks. <laughs> <laughs> got my training from him. <laughs> oh, oh my gosh. God. What are some of your other dreams? I do so many. I'd like to be right now where you are. That's my biggest dream. She keeps saying that. Because I have to. I haven't done it all. Yes, you have. 
and so every much more. every artist would like to be in your shoes, and that's where I'm. Since I'm an artist, just starting, just beginning, that's where I'd like to be. That's very flattering. Thank you. You're welcome. But there's so much more. It really is. Of course, movies. I don't like when people limit themselves. I don't. No, of course. We have I a lot in common. Of course, movies. Mr. Lynn. And... I'd love to do movies. Yeah. <laughs> you know what it reminds me of right now? What? Paris. It's an, the night does. Yeah, it does. Because listening to the waterfalls and the lights. I like Paris. It's my favorite place. You ever I... been to Europe? You guys? Isn't it nice? I love it. Where have you been? Where were you Cuba? born? Cuba? Oh, oh, wish I could say that. <laughs> I love Germany. I'm oh, from Indiana. My favorite is Paris. Oh, really? She's what? Half Indian. East oh, Indian or American Indian? East Indian. Okay, that's more like it. I'm <laughs> from, my she knows I'm so a big funny. fan of East <laughs> Indian. Oh, is that Bill, why you said that? Who are my people? <laughs> what, what, like, His what ancestors. race? I, no, what race I really like? <laughs> I, I think, no, East Indian. I think they're really beautiful, and the darker they are, the more beautiful. Bill, excuse me. Can you close that door? Your voice is very airy. I know. I hate this green. It's not like Carol Burnett. Can you close that door, Bill, please? Thank you. Anyway, I think uh, we've captured some good magic here. It's the sibling and, uh, tension for me. I think it's a good time to Look at Latoya's this. face. Uh, maybe we can sing a quick song? All right, which one sing? Jingle Bells, no. It's so funny. What, what should we sing? We don't have that um, much time. Let's make it quick. Uh, never can say goodbye? Okay. Never, never can, can say goodbye. No, 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 I never can say goodbye. You take it. Even though the pain and heartaches seem to follow me wherever I go, Though I try and try to hide my feelings, they always seem to show. It's that same oh. old dizzy hangout that keeps me going over. Isn't this terrible? I didn't even know Tell the lyrics. Me why. This is our ending. Is it so? Da, 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 da. Don't want to let you go. Is that it? Be quiet. My phone just fell. Off the camera? <laughs> I know it. Why is that been on television? I still love to be filmed. Not because I'm vain. I am so glad to kill you. Not because I'm vain. I like making magic. Of course, honey. <clears throat> of course, honey. Uh. Hi. For those of you who don't know, I'm Latoya. And I come from a rather large family, a family of two girls and six brothers. When I was a little girl, I used to watch all of my brothers rehearse every single day, not knowing that one day, they would be the famous Jackson 5. And I never had a dream that I would be a part of this as well because I never wanted a part of music in my life. I wanted nothing to do with it just by watching them oh rehearse God, every nails. day and struggling. And my father making them do it over and over. It became so repetitious. I said, no, I don't want a life like that. And I don't want to be a part of that. And then it just all clicked and I became, I guess, 16, 17 years old. There I was on stage, loving every single minute of it. And I love it today. I'm trying very hard to succeed. Aww. One of my biggest dreams was always to really meet the Beatles because they were so big. And Michael decided to do a film with Paul McCartney because they had been writing together. And before you knew it, there I was in the video, Say, 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 with him as a part of the video. And we all work together. They're such wonderful people, Paul and Linda McCartney, and, and of course the others in the family. And we just had a ball. We were out at Los Alamos. That's where we filmed it. We were there for about a week, and it took four shooting days. And it was just great. Very easy to work with, and it was very simple. It was wonderful. And I enjoyed every single minute of it. And it was one of my dreams just to really just meet him, not knowing that a couple of years later I would be working with him as well. And I hope in the future I'll be able to do more work with him and other people as well. You know what I like about the last part of this interview? I love seeing them together. I'm saying like um, Michael La and Latoya because I've always seen videos of him and Janet together because 
as far as like out of the two sisters it always seemed like him and janet was like the closest especially since they did like a video to that together they did scream together or whatever um but i would like to see him like i would like to see other videos because i know they're out there but i would like to see other videos of him interacting with his siblings because i always see him with janet but yeah this was a really sweet video to watch i really enjoyed <laughs> i really enjoyed that last part because i could tell that there was just like some sibling ten tension just like there always is with siblings but they gotta keep it cute for the camera but i already know like they always go back and forth with each other but yeah y'all that was my reaction to this video if you guys enjoyed my reaction please make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe and i will see you in my next reaction video bye